going kayaking with the two hours we have left before Brandon's flight. Should be fun as long as the clouds don't open up on us. I always clip my keys to my life vest. Okay. Put my sunglasses down. Boomer, you ready for a swim? Ooh, it's bright. I created an addict. As soon as the weather's nice enough and the kids are gone, the first thing Brandon wants to do is kayak. Yeah. <laughs> Thumbs up, honey. You're a fishing pole. <laughs> Check that out. Awesome water dog Boomer. Swimming like a champ. I need to get him a life vest. We lost his in the fire last year. I gotta get him a new one. Gorgeous day to be on the river. Poor Boomer. Boomer's getting old. We're gonna be getting him some canine health when we're at our business meetings this weekend. He's starting to show signs of wear. He's only swam about a mile and now he's done. <laughs> Not even a mile. At least it's pretty. He's fine. He can go across the field and get to the house. Straight up there is, I mean, there's a field and it goes straight to our house. It might. I hear something over there. It's either fishes or turtles. I've seen a bunch of turtles today too. Maybe it's a Loch Ness. A Loch Ness? What's a Loch Ness? Loch Ness. A Loch Ness monster? Yeah. <laughs> You're a dork. Hey, over there. You see that little dot? Boomer. He's so tired. We are not catching anything. I mean, granted, it is the wrong time of day to be fishing. Guys, biking it back to the house after kayaking. Whew, I didn't kayak hard. I wanted to get a little bit of exercise, but not a ton. But Brandon took the kayaks back and I'm on the bike now. Be a long day. You ready for your flight or are you nervous? A little nervous. Bye, Daddy. Bye.